welcome back. Today we will talk about a new lesson that I know you love. But before that, let us first look at these images. In a swimming competition, Analita got the third place, Lexi in the second place, and the champion is Grace. Do you also dream about joining in any competition? I know you do. Now, let us count these fruits from Rodrigo's plate. So, he has 1, 2, 3 oranges and 2 bananas. Should we also eat fruits like Rodrigo? Yes, of course. Based on my examples, do you know what are we going to talk today? Today, we will learn about cardinal and ordinal numbers. A cardinal number is a number that tells how many of a thing there are, like 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. While an ordinal number is a number that tells the position of a thing in a list Like 1st, 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th, and so on. Please note that most ordinal numbers ends with letters TH. Except for ordinal numbers like 1st, 2nd, and 3rd. Let us look at these examples. What have you noticed? As what you can see, cardinal numbers are just mainly numbers. However, in ordinal numbers, you can already see the position of each number. So when we say, he got the first place, what number am I referring to? Is it cardinal or ordinal? Ordinal, correct! Why? Because it refers to the position of a number. So in cardinal number, the numbers are only written on its simplest and normal form. Alright, let's answer the following. Get a piece of paper and pencil and write the correct answer in cardinal or ordinal form. Ready? Get set? Go! Correct! 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 Well done, kids! I know you've learned a lot today. See you again next time. Bye! That's all for now. Visit my website, subscribe to my channel, and turn on notifications for more videos. You can also like and follow me on my social media accounts. 
Continue e-learning with me, your teacher Gian. See you on the next video. Bye!